Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new XD tutorials and today I'll show you the like login page UI design. So this one is too much simple but are uh, like creative. So let's start the tutorial. If you are new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. So at first I took an artboard uh, for the iPhone X, XS or 11 Pro, 12 Pro, whatever it is. And then I just done this one. If I go to the home, you will get the uh, size over there, lots of size over there, XR, Max, and iPad, Google Pixel, but I took this one and if you take this one, you are getting like that. And after that, just press alter option button and make another output copy of this. So here uh, I'll import the photo and then I'll do work with that. So how to do that going to the file and going to the import so anyway uh, for the windows user you will get the three lines over there and that is the menu bar instead of the this i'm using the mac that's why i'm just getting this one as a file going to the import options i downloaded a stock image from unsplash.com and this picture i'll work with that or i'll use for this ui design so making this one a little bit bigger okay fine now i'll mask it out before that you have to place the proper position of this one then here going to the like rectangle or square tool and drawing rectangle like this and select all the stuffs right press and mask with the shape if this option not appear in your options or in your xd uh, you have to select those things properly otherwise it won't appear over there right press and mask with the shape okay and here i'll import the logo going to the file again and import options sometimes you will get the import options to by right click so it depends on the mac or pc this version just making okay making it smaller like this now I'll write down text over here, going to the text tool and drawing an area like this. So write down like a little bit things and from here just like that paste over there. Here the color I'll make it white and I'm using here the Helvetica and I'll use this one medium and make it in the middle element. Okay and place it in a closest of this one now i'll make two buttons going to the shape and just making button like this rounded button v and making another button from here and i'll give the color the border and turn off the border and give the fill color like blue so select fill color blue like this that's good and now i'll write down the text from here before that i'll insert here and like uh, some icons i downloaded the icons from freepeak.com and i'll provide you that download link in my video description so i'm taking these three things are uh, the flickr and the linkedin and the vns copying this one going to the city and paste it out normal or simple controller command v and controller command c okay fine and i'll write down something uh, new user so giving the question marks and alignment will be in middle and now here i'll make it a little bit smaller that's it so keeping outside of that and alter option button and make copy and press the shift and hold it it will show you the proper alignment of this and pick color from here and use this color okay now text going to the text tool and writing something over here before that you have to make this one black with email okay, fine and making it in middle of this select this two shape and the text making it like this and 
sign up with Facebook. I'm giving the text color white. That's it. Now this portion is done. Now we'll make this portion. So at first uh, I'll take the rectangle for the background for the background purpose I'm turning off the border okay that's good and here uh, rest of the thing is that here i will make the shadow so giving here the shadow value 6 and here as well the shadow the value is 6 that's good and you can give the shadow if you want so here the shadow it will be pop up actually so the alignment will be middle make sure that that is the middle alignment okay now uh, we'll take the circle bigger like that turn off the border and making it in the middle that's what it could be a little bit bigger so that's fine okay and giving the color any other color for the recognition and making it middle that's it and now going to the file and import and this one that means the photo leaf photo I'll import over here making it smaller like this okay, like that and I'll send this photo into the back layer actually here is another uh, shape so select only these two things mask with the shape now that is good now i'll make the circle here here is the circle tool make a circle turn off the border giving some shadow it will appear and giving this one value six that's good and placing over here now i'll draw the cross line or like plus like that drawing like this and stroke i will giving this one three that's good ctrl c and ctrl v or you can make another copy of this actually you have to rotate this one so here is the rotation that is 90 degree should be that's good and middle of this selecting these two things making it group and press the shift and hold it and making it rotation and place it in the middle of the circle select these two things making it proper alignment of this so like that okay now just taking this one by pressing alter option button and placing it in the middle and another one is middle and three things three button actually so this one i'll add some color which is like this that's good i'm just copying this one and filling it up okay and filling it up that's it i'm turning off the shadow actually and i'm giving here the border border that is 0.25 is good for me and here the border only 0.25 that's good and i'll write something over here taking the same text by pressing alter option button uh, it will help me out to keep the text size same actually that's why i'm using that uh, like and now i'll give here the password like drawing some circle like this turning off the border giving the fill color like this that's fine and select this one and here the replace grid making it like that okay I'll making it uh, like 15 13 13 is good and now making it in the middle of this so here the text color should be same of this one okay that's fine email password and now i'm giving here sign in 
okay make sure that is the middle of that so here i'm giving the border which is only 0.25 that's fine okay the detail same detail just giving over here or you can use the uh, like a uh, human figure like this so making circle okay and here just making it in the middle and i'll place any kind of photo over here will be the file and import suppose this photo photo i'll import too much big making it smaller by pressing shift and pressing over here by placing here just giving mask with the shape making it bigger like this That's good. so this portion I'll add some border which is the white color it will help me out to recognize the I'll copy this one and V and turn off the fill giving the border only white color it will help me how to recognize this so everything would be like that and now I'll take this one into here okay make sure that is the middle that's good and I'll increase the font size into 20 pt that's good make sure that in the middle of this you are getting the simple UI by using the Adobe HD so you can make modification like this or that it's totally up to you make sure this one is the middle of that okay fine this one is really easy to do that you can make easily the login apps or UI design by using the Adobe HD so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on my video comment section until the next video i mean signing up today bye